aren't we glad that 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 Ellen has another TV show on because she doesn't work enough. She doesn't work enough. She doesn't have enough jobs. I have seen an episode of Game of Games, and I have never seen anybody be dropped into that big a vat of macaroni and cheese. Yeah. As you did to somebody. Yes. The, 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 the logistics of that have got to be insane. Yeah, it's a big, it's a big set. It's a big, and this, this season, this new season, is bigger. bigger. We had to use the biggest soundstage on this lot to, in order to get the games in. To spin two people around to the point of nausea yep. and, and risk physical, physical injury. Right. Anybody, everybody, like, almost drown in that vat of macaroni and cheese? We pull them out pretty quickly. Do you have lifeguards on standing by with, <laughs> with special vests? Well, they they're not really lifeguards, but yes, we have people to pull them out, and so it's not always macaroni and cheese. Sometimes it's pea soup. There's different things we drop them into. Who writes your show? Toddlers? Uh huh. Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes. What? You know what would be funny, mommy? If mommy fell into into mashed potatoes. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's that kid. Well, that's, that's a young kid. That's a young kid. Yeah. That's actually a really good idea. Just have a room full of young people and ask them what they want to see on TV yeah. and then create it. That's right. What if we had a room full of sharp forks? <laughs> <laughs> and they had to find their way out blindfolded. <laughs> Is that coming up anytime soon? Actually, now that might be the Halloween version. No of, one take uh, that. You know, I'm writing it. They're I'm writing it. Writing it um, by the way, you do a good impression of a child. Thank you. You really do. <laughs> um, I'm in touch. Your family was in uh, in Greece recently. We go to Greece on our on yeah. our holiday vacation because Rita's family is from there. Uh, yes, and so therefore there are no options to go anywhere uh -huh, else. Right. We will go to Greece, and that's that. That's all there is to it. It's pretty beautiful. Well, it beats my family, which came from Red Bluff, California. Yeah. So <laughs> might be a little bit better to go to Greece. Better water. So you're you're on a on a, a nice fancy yacht, and you decide you're going <laughs> to jump off the fancy yacht. There's, right. There's uh, can we see this? I don't I don't know how many takes it uh, you did. Oh. How many times did you jump off? Well, this was my birthday. Uh -huh. Now I was just I wanted to show off the new hat and shirt that I got for my 63rd birthday. But we had we were we it took a while to our production team went off. If mm -hmm. you have the you have an earlier take of this that didn't quite work out. As I well haven't as we seen the earlier to. take. I well, wanted... here's what here we're going, and there I go, right? <laughs> right that's, uh, didn't quite have the same celebratory visual. No. That we were looking looking for, but no. it was the same uh, imagining technology. Uh, there we go. There but that go. was pretty high. But then I saw your son jumped off a cliff. Okay. Yeah. How high was that? Because that. I, I'm no judge of height. I'm going to say it's six miles high. Um, this is him. He marched up. He swam to shore, climbed up on beach, walked all the way up to the top of this mountain, and he wasn't waiting more than three seconds before Look at he this. did this. Look at this. I mean, I cannot believe this he did it. this. That was him. One, two, three, four. That's four seconds of hang time. That's the type of fall that will rip a watch off your wrist. Is he usually a daredevil like that? Uh, he, yeah, he is. He, well, does, he rides motorcycles. And, yeah. uh, and when we were, uh, when he turned, uh, I think, 21, he wanted to go, uh, I said, what would you like for your birthday? He said, uh, I want to go skydiving. So we Is we that went, how he talks? We went, <laughs> <laughs> after, after he ponders things. Uh, so we went, uh, we went tandem skydiving. A tandem, so you're attached to somebody who knows what they're doing. Right. You, you free fall, and as you're free falling, your face goes like this. <laughs> yeah. As you go, because you're traveling like at 250 miles an hour. Right. And uh, then she popped the chute. And we stopped, and she was doing this thing of swinging us around, steering us around. Oh, wow. And I had had a huge breakfast burrito before the plane went off. And so I, I truly, I, I begged her. I'm just, I was like a rag doll hanging <laughs> from this harness. Like, please stop. Please, please stop, stop. And we landed on this grat strip, and all I could do was sit on my rump, and I just had to sit there for about seven minutes waiting for my stomach to calm down while other people were coming down and landing. Well, I have up. to say, maybe having a huge breakfast burrito before you're going to jump out of bad a plane. Bad call. Bad. Bad call. Yes. I, had smart. I been with you, I would have said, don't eat the whole thing. It was a damn good burrito, Oh, I'm sure. Though. I'm it sure. It was really good. All right. So we're going to both be at the Golden Globes this year. You're getting uh, the Lifetime Achievement Cecil Award. Cecil B. DeMille Award. Award. You're Award. getting the Carol Burnett Award. Yes. We're that? both getting... <laughs> now... That's exciting. That, first of all, 
First of all, I'm just flattered and honored that I'm getting that, but I'm so glad that this well, does year... this mean you're now going to have a variety show on the air as well? So there'll be this, the game show, and the... And then the and fork show. That, the, the... Yeah. <laughs> I'm just excited because uh, the fact that you're getting the Cecil B. DeMille Award um, when I'm getting the Carol Burnett Award, it's just going to be... I'm so excited for you because I think that's so cool well, that I you. get to be there on that show well, with you. And likewise, yes. you've, you, you and I have been essentially on television since VHS. Uh, was first invented. That, is, that you know? is true. It's literally about the same time. We uh, one of the first time I saw you and got to know you was at something called the American Comedy Awards. Remember that? Yes, it was just for the American comics. Yes, and yes. for some reason, <laughs> for some reason, I was there, and it was an award show that was on for a little bit. But this was 1984, 85, yeah. something like that. And you won for what? Did you win? I have no idea. You won. I think you won for for best female club comic. Okay. Was it, could, does that sound about right? Sure. Which means that you, <laughs> you got to travel around the world and perform at the Chuckle Hut yeah. and, uh, and I was uh, the Laughs best, Incorporated. The best female to do that. That's I was right. the best female at the Chuckle Hut. You. <laughs> yeah. All right. We're going to talk to Tom more after this. We'll be back.